Welcome back fellow Saints and other life forms of Saint TCG and in today's video we have the Namekian Boost expansion set from the Unison Warrior series. So in this in this thing you get a it says you get ten uh expansion cards, a dice, and two uh, set thirteen and one uh, extra 1EB01 booster pack, which, what is that, oh, the evolution, the battle evolution pack, so you get two, two, uh, supreme rivalry and one battle evolution pack in these, so, let's get into it, I think that's kind of weird, I thought they were gonna be, like, three of the supreme rivalry, but... Let's just see. Ooh. That's right. The uh the dice for this one's supposed to be the Sorry about that. Uh, I had a sneeze. I didn't want to sneeze on camera, so I I had to pause it real fast. But yeah, the dice on these were supposed to be the the Black Star Dragon Balls or the uh, the Dark Dragon Balls, I, I mean. So they're supposed to be like this dark blue color. That's pretty cool. And we'll go ahead and just open both. So I believe you get two of each promo card, so there's only five cards. And so you get ten cards in total, but two copies of each. So there's another dark dragon ball. And let's let's see the cards. And my apologies on the last video if the quality was down. Uh, I, f I just got a new memory card, so I was trying to record <laughs> higher definition. But I totally forgot to check when I recorded if I had bumped it up. Because I think that, I think I'm streaming, or I'm recording just below 4K. My phone can do 4K. But, um, my phone's still older, so it can only go so long. I should be getting, like, an, I should be getting another one. So, in the future, there should be 4K videos. But, for now, we're streaming, or we're recording just below that. So it's still over 1080p. It's like the one in between there. So these are silver foil. And you actually get two foil copies. I thought one of them was going to be unfoiled. Or not foil. And one of them was going to be foiled. But they're both foil. So we get Piglo Spirit Booster Defender. He's a two cost. Two yellow uh, unison. 11k power, auto, once per turn, when you activate the blocker skill on one of your yellow battle cards, add a marker to this card. Then his other auto, once per turn. When you remove a marker from this card using spirit boost skill, choose one of your opponent's battle cards with an energy cost greater than their current energy and negated skills for the turn. Then, uh, for plus one, activate main. Choose one of your... Yellow battle cards and switch it to active mode at the start of your opponent's next main phase. So, if you're swinging with something and you don't want it to get attacked next turn, you could switch it to, uh, you, could, you could untap it. So that they have to get rid of your card with a skill or something like that in order to get over it. So, not too bad, I guess. 
I think this is supposed to be for the Gohan or something, or the uh, Trunks. Because next we have Sun Gohan, Spirit Boost Vindicator, and this is a future Gohan. So he is a two cost, uh, two yellow specified cost, two cost card, 10k power, auto. If it's your turn, when this card is played from your hand, choose one of your opponent's skillless battle cards in rest mode and KO it. Then activate main for one yellow. If your leader card is a mono is mono yellow, and you place this card in its owner's drop barrier, play one yellow trunks future card with an energy cost of three from your deck, and then shuffle your deck. And then activate battle, spirit boost one, which is you remove a marker from your unison to play the skill for one yellow play this card from your hand so you don't have to pay the two costs you p you can pay it one and play it as long as you get rid of one of your unison cards markers which you would probably use this piccolo so then you would get his effect to negate one of your opponent's uh battle card skills that's higher than their energy Now, next card, we have Trunks, Spirit Resonance. Kind of wish that these were textured cards instead of just the silver foiling. But, I guess, I guess I'm a little spoiled after having opened the, uh, the premium box that came with the secret rare foiling cards. So... But, I mean, they used to do texture cards on a bunch of stuff. But now they've just gone to, let's just do silver foiling. So he's a three cost, one yellow specified cost. You can bring him out with this Gohan. So that's why they put it together. He has deflect and blocker. Then he has evolve for one yellow over a trunks future. Auto limit one. If your leader card is mono yellow when this card is played or used in a combo from your hand, add one yellow Sun Gohan future with an energy cost of two or less from your deck to your hand, then shuffle this card. Basically you could you could play him, get rid of him for him, and then use his skill to loop and get another one of these so then you can keep Putting trunks on your board, I guess. And then auto for spirit boost two. So remove two markers from your unison. And then pay three yellow. When this card is removed from battle area by an opponent's skill or KO, choose one yellow trunks future card with a cost of eight in your hand and play it. So I believe this was like the card from the set. There was like a trunks that you could play for that. And then next we have Sword Dance of the Demon God with Salsa on it. So it's for one energy, it's a counter attack, negate this negate the attack, then add up to one skillless battle card from your drop area or warp to your hand then activate main uh, spirit boost one so again you remove a marker from your unison and then it has a limit one so you could only activate this skill once per turn across all copies of cards for one energy unison card with a specified cost of one Remove this card from your drop area from the game. Choose one of your opponent's battle cards with an energy cost of four or less and send it to the owner's warp. So basically you can get rid of you can negate the attack, then activate main and remove it from your drop area. 
and banish one of their four less cards to their warp. Not too bad. And then finally, from the promo cards, we have Bojack Pinpoint Onslaught. So it's a blue yellow Bojack. So he has four costs, one blue, one yellow specified cost. He has energy cost, he has 20k. Permanent, if you have a Bojack Brigade card in your energy, reduce the combo cost of this card by one and negate its energy cost skill for the. in all areas. So. If you have one in your energy, he's a free 5k combo, which, I mean, I don't know why he has one cost, but I guess it's so that you, it would be so that you can't, like, combo into play the other Bojack stuff, but then it, it, it has it so that you can, I don't know. And then when this card is played, if you activate the Evolve skill on one of your Bojack cards in your hand, this turn reduce the skill cost of the er or the Evolve by one. So basically you make it cheaper to Evolve on him. Then uh, activate battle for one, one blue. I think it says one blue or yellow because there's like a line, so it's blue or yellow, I guess. There are two or more blue and or yellow cards in your combo area. Play this card from your hand. Choose all other blue and yellow Bojack Brigade cards in your battle area, and they get 5k power for the turn. So he's kind of like the, uh... So he he's kind of like an arrival. <coughs> he's kind of like an arrival for blue yellow, for at least for for the Bojack deck. And then he gives five k. So he's kind of like the Captain Guinea was back in set set one. That when you would play him, he would boost up all the the Guinea Force cards. But this is for Bojack Brigade. So I think that's pretty cool. Definitely bring some support to the Bojack deck. Uh, one second. Sorry about that. Whoa. Uh, I actually went swimming earlier today. And I did like wash out my, wash my face. But like I just got some chlorine in my eye. And it hurt. <laughs> it hurt like hell. So, yeah. I had to pause it real quick. Because, man, my eye was killing me. Hopefully that doesn't happen again. Uh, so now let's get to the packs. And, yeah, we're not going to open that one. So, we'll see which one gets better pulls. So we'll start off with... I think we'll... Do one Supreme Rivalry, then the Battle Evolution, then the other Supreme Rivalry. So, first pack with... Um, what, what is it? It's not Demigrat, it's... Uh, what's his face? I forgot what his name is. And then Goku. So, we got Shugash. Uh, we got Vegeta. We got the Smoke Dragon. We got Chile Vanilla. We got Future Gohan. We got Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Thwarting the Dark Empire. We got Krillin. We got uh, Android 20 or Dr. Jiro. Then we got Yearning for the Dark Dragon Balls. We got Vegeta the Young Invader. Then we got Frieza Demolisher of Planet Vegeta as a uh, foil. And Toby Fiend Greeting. Of course, we know we're Saiyans and we hate Frieza. He killed it. He killed everyone. We'll never forget. Now to battle evolution. Let's see 
Maybe we could pull the secret rare out of these two packs. Who knows? So we got Super 13 Unison. We got Master Roshi. Negate. Uh, the Bulma Leader. Assault of the Great Apes. We got Android 15. Broly the Tame Beast. We got Shining Blaster. We got Sensu Bean. We got Fearless Assault Krillin. We got Broly Dawn of Rampage. We got Android 17 Restrained Support Foil. And Android 16 Steadfast Ally. So, we are two for two for deads. Let's hope that this one has a foil. I don't know if there's like a full ratio of how many rares you're supposed to get from these. Or foils. So, let's see. Then we got Goku. We got Android 18. We got Goku again. We got Kabira. We got Tora. We have Wings. We have Trunks. Zeno. We got Full Power Unleashed. My boy Trunks. Bodying uh, Goku. We have Android 16. We got Gravy. We have Frieza revive, Revived and Reviled Foil. And Son, Goku, Son Gohan Trusted Ally. So, no hollow rares or anything out of those. We just got foils. Two of them being Frieza. Now let's see if the other side is more generous to us. Let's hope so. So we have Goten. We have King Cold. We have Kabira. We have Cooler. We have Dark Broly. We have Gohan. Piccolo. Kikono. We have the Champ to the Rescue. We have Dark Shenron, the Wicked Wishmaster. We have Beto, the Cruel Foil. And we have Invasion of Bardock's Crew as a foil. Er, as a regular rare. Man. <laughs> These are beating us up. <laughs> Wrong pack. Battle Evolution. Can you give us something? So we have Rebrian, the power of support. We have Super Saiyan Bardock, Never Ending Vengeance. We have Android 16 Leader. We have Assault of the Great Apes. We have Chiaotzu, Sorrel and Hop. We have Cataplasia, Universe 3 Policeman. We have Tien. We have Haru Haru. Bonds of Friendship 8, Android 8. We have Dream the Future as a reverse foil. And Super 13 Core of the Trio. This is terrible. Come on, can we get something? Or are we going to get shut out with all terrible pulls? Final pack, we have Goku, we have a t Chain Attack Fasha, we have King Cold, we have Demon God Tora, or Toa, we have Gohan, we have Tora, we have Gohan Vanilla, we have Furious Awakening, Bojack Leader, Full Power Unleashed, we have Vegeta's energy fortification as a foil and Demon God Protein revival at hand. So we didn't get any foils out of this, out of these two Namekian power or booster things. That is, t <laughs> that is terrible. I was at least expecting to get one foil out of them. But then, of course, they did this whole two packs from one set, one pack from another set. 
which probably made doing ratios impossible. So, this has been pretty sad. We didn't get... All we got was reverse foils and reverse foil promos. Hopefully, the Saiyan Boost one will at least give us something. I mean, come on. It's, it's Saiyan's. This, this us. So let's hope for something better in the next video. Till then, I hope you guys uh, stay safe out there. Uh, I'm technically recording this before uh, 4th of July for everyone in the U.S. So happy yeah, 4th of July. And yeah. Stay tuned for the next video. Of course, we will be opening the Sane Boost next. And as always, thanks so much for watching. This is Sane TCG. Till next time.